What is going on, everybody? Welcome back to Michael Knapp Fishing. Um, it's been a crazy, uh, crazy few weeks. Um, you know, we, we came out and we did a real review video for y'all like last week or something like that. And then uh, we were going to go out and film some more. And uh, yeah, we got like eight inches of snow out here. Um, it just, it blistered down on us. So uh, we're not really going to be able to go out fishing today either, obviously. But uh, so we're going to do a gear review video for you guys that I just got a, a new product in the mail. Um, I'm multitasking while I'm talking. Sorry. Um, I just got a new product in the mail. Um, if, for those of you who have power poles, um, you know, we we have the original power pole covers that come with them. I assume they all come with them. I don't really know. Um, mine did, though. So we've got those power pole covers there. And they're neoprene, you know, they, uh, they rip easily, um, when they get like sun damaged and everything. So I wanted to get a new pair of power pole covers. Well, I didn't want to get just anything, you know, in particular, like I wanted, I wanted something, something nice, something that I picked out. So we got what we wanted in, um, they are very cool. So we're going to do a real quick review on them just to kind of uh, keep a little bit of content flowing for you guys. I know it's been tough right now. We're going to get back on the water ASAP uh, with it being the new year and everything and Christmas just got over with. Um, we're going to try and get back on our schedule and whatnot. So I'm going to show you guys the new Rod Warrior um, power pole covers. Uh, they make a bunch of different sizes. So uh, we're going to check these out. We're going to put them on the boat. It's going to be a real quick video, but uh, we're going to do it. We're going to get into it. So let's go, guys. So Rod Warrior is the company that I used to get my new rod covers from. Um, so we're gonna check, we're gonna unroll these bad boys, just kind of check them out. I was really hoping I was gonna have somewhere to put you all, but uh, see if I can't maybe get some of this snow off my boat. Oh yeah, that's cold. All right, let's see if we can set it there. Ooh. Are you gonna set there? Maybe. All right. So hopefully that sun's not killing you all. But uh, these are the power pull covers that we had custom made for us that I'm, I'm actually really excited about. Um, they're really cool. All right, let's see here. Let's see if I can get them up here for you guys. Check that out. We've got it saying Michael Knapp Fishing on it. Uh, we did go with red since our boat is black, white, and red. Um, they do have a convenient snap over here that should allow them to snap into place and uh, not come off. They are referred to as um, as travel uh, travel covers, so you're technically able to ride with these down the road because that's what I wanted them for. You know, I didn't. I unplugged my boat by accident. <laughs> I didn't want, uh, you know, just basic covers that we were going to be leaving on them at the house and stuff. You know, that doesn't really do me any good because my boat used to always be undercover. I'm turning all the snow off now. My boat used to always be undercover, but uh, now that I've gotten the new cover on, I don't know if y'all can really see it. I, you probably can. Um, now that I've gotten the new cover for the boat, um, I don't really keep it under the cover much anymore because the cover was up at my parents' house. And I'm constantly doing tackle and filming and stuff. And I really needed my boat up here at my house. Granted, it's not really that far away, but I still really wanted it at my house so that I was able to just walk out my porch and be able to work on it. Um, I planned on doing a different video today that I was gonna be able to show you all some new stuff on the boat that we just got done. But uh, there's probably about an inch of ice under six inches of snow on this. So um, we're just gonna save that for another day. We're uh, we're kind of discussing now whether or not we're even gonna get to go fishing tomorrow. But um, all right. So anyway, the the, the power pole covers we've got these out now. Uh, I'm gonna install them. Well, you don't really install them. Let's be for real here. It's, it's mostly just sliding them on and off. Um, we're gonna see if I can do this one handed while I have you all on camera with me. Um, oof. All right. There's the old power pole cover coming off. All right, ooh, cool. And I can actually lay you all on there now so that you're not in the snow anymore either. 
Well, I guess it's brand new, so I've got to try and figure out which one is which, I guess. Um, I don't know if it, I would imagine the writing would need to go on the outside. Oh. Okay, no, this, this one goes over here. Okay. That's the right power pole, so let's get the left one. All right, we got the left power pole now, I assume. It should be anyway, since the other one fits the right side. Yeah, all right, here we go. This is the left side power pole. All right, so we're just gonna, gonna do this number here and get it up there. And then it should slide right on just like so. Just like that. Heck yeah, that looks good. That looks great. And then, where's that snap at? That snap is somewhere on here I'm trying to reach. All right, so we've got the left side power pull put on here. I'll grab y'all real quick and kind of show you. And look at that. I love it. I'm obviously gonna do a close up for you guys of it and, and uh, show you all, but it's, it's actually a really nice setup. Um, they have the snaps on there. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and put on the right one now. And then we're gonna do a close up for you guys. And uh, like I said, it's gonna be a really quick video. All right, so I've got y'all turned around now. Here are the Rod Warrior neoprene power pole covers right there. We'll get a nice shot on there for them. Guys, I am not in any way sponsored by them. Uh, these were not free. I did pay for them. So uh, please don't be like all these other kids on my Instagram page and think I get everything for free because as much as I'd love that, it don't happen. <laughs> all right, so I'm trying to get that sun under there. So these uh, retail for, I believe, $60 each. So it's 120 for the two of them. Um, but the cool thing about these that I really loved, uh, there were no zippers involved. So you were actually able to just slide it over like y'all saw me do. Um, and then, so down here, I'll go ahead and show you guys the snap. Um, move that out of the way. That's just some extra security. So they come down and they fall down like this. And then you actually just fold this one under. Come over here. You see, I can actually do this one-handed. And there's a snap there. And then just snap that. Well, I said I could do it one-handed. But I am left-hand stupid, so you have to bear with me. I am not a, a lefty unless it comes to reeling. And then you just snap it on there like so. And that snapped on there. Now, what you can do for secondary precaution reasons is you can actually take this strap and go underneath the power pole here. And then you can restrap it over there just to make sure that you have an extra level of security. Um, I don't really feel that it's necessary, but uh, I probably will do them while I'm traveling down the road just so that it's not swinging around and smacking against my poles and everything. I really don't think it's gonna hurt them any, but still just to be safe, I would rather not have those swinging around. So guys, there they are the new power pole covers. I think they look pretty good, that red. Um, that red looks pretty sweet on the boat. Uh, it'd look even better if uh, if the boat wasn't covered in snow. Anyway, like I said, it was gonna be a short video, guys. I just wanted to get out here and get something done for you all. Um, I know that we've really slacked off in the month of November, December. You know, we had a lot of crazy things happen that we just weren't expecting, a lot of untimely deaths. and. And just crazy weather, bad fishing predicaments. And with, with all the COVID anglers that were out, the lakes had stupid amounts of pressure on them. You know, we just, we weren't able to really get out as much as I wanted to. Um, but we're going to kick 2020 off, 2021 off with a bang. Uh, we're going to try and get some great content out to y'all. We've got a surprise for y'all for the, uh, I'm going to try and put out a January 1st video. I keep saying that. I'm going to try to. Uh, it's going to be, uh, we're, we're just going to kind of look back at 2020 a little bit and kind of give a little, uh, some behind the scenes stuff that maybe not everybody saw and all that jazz. But, uh, guys, if you like this video, do me a huge favor, hit that like button, hit that subscribe button. Leave me a comment down in the comment section below. Let me know if you've ever used Rod Warrior USA. If you haven't, let me know if you're thinking about it. Uh, what else? I think that's it guys. Hope y'all had a great day. Have a had a Merry Christmas since it just passed. I'll take care guys. I'll see y'all on the water.